Tomorrow morning, starting off the day with mostly cloudy skies, we should see some clearing by midday and then heading into Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, partly to mostly sunny conditions with some increasing cloud cover in the afternoon. Forecast models are kind of toying with the idea of a scattered shower Wednesday, late afternoon, early evening. Not super high confidence that we're going to see much rain. Could see a sprinkle, uh, but I do expect Wednesday to mostly be dry. And I expect most of the day Thursday to be dry too, partly to mostly sunny. But we have a front moving in and the timing is still in a flux a little bit, but we are expecting late Thursday into early Friday for this cold front to move through and bring with it, yes, perhaps some rain and cooler temperatures. But the way things are standing now, much of Thursday actually looks dry. Now temperatures will be responding to that exiting system into the low 50s across the region by tomorrow evening. So at least, you know, we have temperatures that will be warming by about 10 to 15 degrees by tomorrow afternoon. It'll be breezy at times too, but by Wednesday evening, temperatures will warm another almost 20 degrees and we're going to be back to about 70 degrees. Now, Thursday, we could see temperatures even warmer. I wouldn't be surprised to see high temperatures at least getting closer to 80 degrees. But then after that brief warm up, temperatures look to be cooling down quite a bit too. Heading into Friday, we should see highs returning back to below average levels. Here we are about mid 60s and then with some clouds and showers, temperatures will drop throughout the day Friday too. With some clouds and showers Saturday, but look at that high temperature Saturday. Yeah, looking like a pretty cold weekend. 48, partly sunny with scattered showers Saturday, Sunday, partly sunny. And temperatures, high temperatures, will only get into the mid 40s at this point. But we should once again slowly warm up early next week with improving conditions back in the 60s by the middle of next week. But yeah, it'll take a little while to get there. We're getting a few days back in the 70s, but then a few more after that in the 40s again. The best part is there's no blizzard in the